They start on the roof, around vents, skylights, antennas, and ladder mounts. Water leaks, an RV owner's number one problem. The fact is, water needs just a minor hole to create major damage. Why are leaks so common? Because most sealants used in RV manufacturing and repair today are highly solvent-based, which means that 40% of what you apply to the roof will disappear into thin air over time. These sealants never cure or reach a permanent state. They continue to dry out over time, causing the product to shrink and lose flexibility. As the RV travels on the road, heating and cooling, cracks form in the caulking. Fortunately, there is a solution. Cicaflex 715. Corain RV is a family operated business since 1968. Over the years, we've grown into four locations and served many, many customers. When we scrape and reseal the roofs, we decided to use Sikaflex based on the longevity of the sealant, the durability, the ease of use. Uh, we get great feedback from the customers. Sikaflex 715 is a one component semi self leveling roofing sealant with excellent adhesion and good weatherability and it's suitable for sealing a wide variety of roofing components. Here's why. Sikaflex 715 provides an excellent semi-leveling characteristics flow to conform to the parts, but not flow away from the profiles. In short, it stays where it's dispensed. Cross-linking chemistry in Sikaflex 715 cures to provide a durable elastic seal. From extreme cold to hot and humid, Sikaflex 715 remains stable in even the harshest environments. Unlike the highly solvent-based roof sealants with VOCs that typically measure greater than 30 percent, Sikaflex 715 has a VOC content of less than 0.5 percent, which means what you use stays, so it keeps on sealing without shrinking or cracking. It's important to make sure that you apply Sikaflex 715 properly to take advantage of all its benefits. Here's a demonstration. First, before you start any roofing repair project, you need to make sure you have the proper safety equipment and tools. This includes eye protection, gloves, a dust mask, and non-slip shoes. To remove the damaged sealant, You'll want a broom and some removal tools such as a stiff putty knife and hand drill with some non-abrasive wheels. Here's how to prep your RV's roof. Step one is to thoroughly clean and evaluate the RV roof surface per your RV manufacturer's recommendations and instructions. Allow the roof surface to dry before removing the old sealant. Step two is to completely remove all loose and existing sealant around the vents, skylights, antenna mounts, and trim. Start at the front and move toward the back of the unit. Carefully remove old sealant using a stiff putty knife. For better results, warm the putty knife first. To clean up additional loose materials, use a handheld drill with a non-abrasive wheel attachment. It's important to remove all the old sealant all the way down to the roof membrane, metal flanges, and plastic surfaces. Special care should be taken not to cut or damage the rubber roof membrane. Step 3. Remove the old sealant debris from the roof area using a broom or industrial vacuum. Employ a soft brush to clean around all the vents and over the trim pieces to remove the remaining small debris and dust. If you have an air hose, blow the entire roof surface clean. Now you're ready to apply the new sealant. Sikaflex 715 self-leveling sealant has been engineered for easy dispensing. You could use either a good manual caulk gun, a battery operated one, or a pneumatic caulk gun. Before applying Sikaflex 715 to the RV roof seams, we recommend that all surfaces should be clean, dry, free of oil and grease, and of sound quality. It's very important that you do not use a petroleum distillate solvent-based cleaner, such as mineral spirits, to clean the surfaces. 
because solvents absorb into the membrane and will affect the sealing performance. Using solvents on certain roof membranes may void the membrane roof manufacturer's warranty. For weathered roofs, we recommend a simple soap and water solution or roof manufacturer recommended product to clean the roofs. Let the roof dry prior to applying Cicaflex 715. For new roofs, all surfaces must be pre-treated with a special Cica, CicaSense 350211 surface treatment and allowed to dry for at least two minutes. Contact your Sika sales representative for more information on this product. Because Sika Flex 715 is a semi-self-leveling sealant, the goal is to apply a large bead at the seam or profile to be sealed and let the sealant flow uniformly in both directions. To accomplish this, cut approximately one inch off the end of the caulk gun nozzle allowing the opening to dispense the largest possible bead of sealant. We'd recommend a battery-operated gun with adjustable pressure setting to accomplish this. Other options include the typical manual 18 to 1 caulking gun or a pneumatic dispense gun. Apply the sealant slowly so that the finished bead width has a minimum of a half inch wide overlap onto the roof membrane. When applying, Special care must be taken so that no air pockets are allowed to form between the sealant and the substrates, particularly when two beads join each other. Cicaflex 715 can fully cover full trim rails. Screws should be covered with a large dollop of sealant. Unlike the solvent-based sealants, Cicaflex 715 will not cause your acrylic roof vents to crack if it comes in contact. Cicaflex 715 will start to skin over in approximately 45 minutes and the curing process begins immediately. Full curing requires a minimum two to five days depending on climate conditions and sealant thickness. After the skin forms on the sealant, your RV can be moved, transported or driven outdoors, even in rainy conditions. We have a customer's unit that needs a full roof reseal. We actually upsell them into the Sikafex product for the use uh, and durability of the product. And we've been getting rave reviews from the customers. So in the future, we will continue to use Sikaflex products. For specific RV roofing application, please contact Sika's technical service, tsmh at us.sika.com. For the number one problem in RVs, don't just patch leaks, cure them with Cicaflex 715.